Good morning all. Welcome to XNR 365. In this video, we are going to discuss about the important current affairs of 3rd February 2022. Please watch the video till the end. We will ask you a question at the end of this video and please give your answer in the comment section. Let's dive in. Which country has signed 500 million US dollar credit line with India to import fuel? The answer is Sri Lanka. The Export Import Bank of India will provide the credit line for purchasing petroleum products. Sri Lanka is struggling with its worst financial crisis in years with the reverses hitting 3.1 billion US dollar in December. Where is the capital of Sri Lanka? Sri Jayavardhana Pura Kote. Who is the president of Sri Lanka? Gotabaya Rajabaksa. Who is the prime minister of Sri Lanka? Mahinda Rajabaksa. What is the currency of Sri Lanka? Sri Lankan Rupee. Who has won the ICC Spirit of Cricket Award 2021? The answer is Daniel Mitchell. New Zealand opener Daniel Mitchell won the ICC Spirit of Award for 2021 for his gesture in T20 World Cup. The International Cricket Council ICC is the world governing body of cricket. Its headquarters is in Dubai, UAE. Who is the chairman of ICC? Greg Barclay. Who is the CEO of ICC? Jeff Aladis. Who has nominated for 2022 Loras World Breakthrough of the Year Award from India? The answer is Neeraj Chopra. Tokyo Olympics gold medalist Neeraj Chopra has been selected as one of the six nominees for the 2022 Loras World Breakthrough of the Year Award. Neeraj Chopra, who won gold medal in Tokyo Olympics, is one of only two Indians to have won individual Olympics gold medal, the other being Abhinav Bindra in air rifle in 2008. India's first graphene innovation center will set up in Kerala. The Kerala government will set up India's first graphene innovation center, a joint project of Digital University Kerala and Center for Materials of Electronics Technology with Tata Steel as industry partner. Center has given note for 86.41 crore project in Kerala. Where is the capital of Kerala? Tirundapuram. Who is the chief minister of Kerala? Pindrai Vijayan. Who is the governor of Kerala? Arif Mohammad Gan. Kerala has published the first ever state paid atlas in India recently. Kumpalangi. It's a village in Kerala. It's the first sanitary napkin free panjayat in India. It is also India's first model tourism village. Which state has implemented One Nation, One Ration Card plan recently? The answer is Chhattisgarh. Chhattisgarh has implemented One Nation, One Ration Card plan enabling the people of state to lift their food grains quota entitled under the food law from any ration shops across the country. With the integration of Chhattisgarh, the One Nation, One Ration Card plan is now operational in 35 states or union territories. Where is the capital of Chhattisgarh? Raipur. Who is the chief minister of Chhattisgarh? Bhubesh Begal. Who is the governor of Chhattisgarh? Anusuya Oiki. Ramesh Dio, who passed away recently, was an actor. Veteran Hindi and Marathi cinema actor Ramesh Dio died of heart attack. Beginning his career as a villain in Hindi cinema with R.D. in 1962, Dio went on to deliver memorable roles alongside Amitabh Bachchan, Rajesh Ganna, Shatrughna Sneha, Hema Malini and Dharmendra in films like Anand, Aapki Kasam, Mere Apne and Dream Girl. World Wetlands Day observed on February 2. 
World Wetlands Day is observed on February to every year to raise the global awareness about the importance of wetlands. This is the first year when the World Wetlands Day will be observed as United National International Day following its adoption by the UN General Assembly on August 30, 2021. What do you mean by World Wetlands and why it's important? The UN defines wetlands as the ecosystems where water is the primary factor controlling the environment and the associated plant and animal life. Wetland provides essential ecosystem services such as water regulation, including food control and water purification. These wetlands, despite being critical for human survival, are disappearing three times faster than forests and are Earth's most threatened ecosystem. Previous day question answer. Name the only athlete who will represent India in Winter Olympics 2022. The answer is Arif Khan. An alpine skier from Kashmir is the only athlete representing India in the Winter Olympics 2022. He has been participating in winter sports events around the world since 2005, representing India more than 127 times. Question of the day. As per Union Budget 2022, virtual digital assets such as cryptos, NFTs to be taxed at what percent? Please give your answer in the comment section. Thanks for watching. If you like this video, please share it with your friends. Also, leave your feedbacks in the comment section. To get daily current affairs notes, please subscribe to our channel. See you tomorrow. Bye. Take care.